Hi, this is David Cadavy with Cadavy.net. Today I'm going to show you how to turn Craigslist into your personal shopper using a service called Pingy.com. Um, right now I could use a, uh, a kitchen cart, I, I think, and I don't have a car, so it's, easy, it's easiest for me if it's somewhere in my neighborhood. So I'm going to search for kitchen cart wicker because I live in the Wicker Park neighborhood of Chicago and there's not a much better way really to filter it. And I'll get more specific, make sure it's in the city of Chicago. And I'll see that there's none on Craigslist right now. Uh, so what I'm going to do is click on this little RSS feed icon. Um, and that will take me to the RSS feed for this search query. And I will copy that and go to the service called pingy.com. Now, I have already set up an account here. Uh, and entered in my phone number and my email address. And what pingy.com is going to do for me is I'm going to enter in my RSS feed from that search query. And whenever something new shows up, Pingy is going to send me a text message and an email. So as soon as a kitchen cart shows up in Wicker Park, then in theory, I will be the first person to respond to it. Now, why do I go through all this trouble to, to, to buy things off of Craigslist? Well, one is because uh, the eight life hacks for wealth, health, and ha for health, wealth, and happiness, uh, buy used is, is one of them. And I just find it to be a little more fun to buy things used. It's more adventure. It's also a lot cheaper, and it's good for the environment. I know there's plenty of kitchen cards out there that are in need of good homes. So... I always feel good when I buy them off of Craigslist, not that I buy a lot of kitchen cards. Anyway, this has been David Cadavy with Cadavy.net, and I hope this helps you turn Craigslist into your personal shopper.